Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to learn about conversion of time. This means we will learn about how to convert the days, hours and minutes. Okay? So before starting this, let's see this relation between days and hours and hours and minutes. In one day, there are 24 hours or in one hour, there are 60 minutes. Okay? Now on the basis of these two relations, we will do some questions. Here the first question is, convert 6 hours into minutes. So here we have to convert the hours into minutes. So what is the relation between these two? In one hour, there are 60 minutes. So let's write this. One hour is equal to 60 minutes. So in 6 hours, there will be how many minutes? We will multiply 6 by 60. 6 multiplied by 60. And now we will write here minutes. This means, now we will multiply these two. There is 1 0. So first we will put 1 0. Then 6 times 6, we will get 36. So the answer will be 360 minutes. This means 6 hours is equal to 360 minutes. Now similarly we will do second question. It is we have to convert 3 hours 30 minutes into minutes. So here we have to convert the hours into minutes. Okay. So first we will break this 3 hours and 30 minutes. So we will convert only this much part. This we will write as it is. So let's write 3 hours plus 30 minutes. So here we will convert only 3 hours into minutes. So how we will convert? As we did in the first question. Similarly to convert this hours into minutes we will multiply this by 60. So let's multiply. 3 multiplied by 60. Now we will change the unit. It is minutes. And then we will add the remaining 30 minutes. Okay. Now let's multiply. 3 multiplied by 60. We will write 1 0. And then 3 times 6. 3 6 hours. It will be 18. 180 minutes plus we will add 30 minutes. Now, what will come after addition? 180 plus 30. It will be 210 minutes. So, our answer will be 210 minutes. Okay? Now, the next one is 5 days into hours. Now, we will use this relation. 1 day is equal to 24 hours. So first we will write the relation. One day is equal to 24 hours. So in 5 days, how many hours will be there? We will multiply 5 by 24. Okay. So 5 days will be equal to 5 multiplied by 24. And we will write the unit hours. Okay, so let's multiply these two. 24 multiplied by 5. So I'm multiplying here. 24 multiplied by 5. 5 fours are 20. We will write 0. 2 we will carry over. 5 fours are 10. 10 plus 2 is 12. So the answer will be 120 hours. This means 5 days is equal to 120 hours. Now we will do the fourth question. It is also based on this relation. Here we have to convert 3 days 13 hours into hours. This means we need to convert only this much part. And the remaining hours we will add. Okay. So let's do this. In one day there are 24 hours. So in 3 days how many hours will be there? 3 multiplied by 24 hours. And now 
we will add 13 hours in this. 13 hours. Okay. Now let's multiply these two. 3 multiplied by 24. What will we get? 24 multiplied by 3. 3 4 is 12. 2 we will write. 1 we will carry. 3 to the 6 plus 1 will be 7. So it will be 72 hours plus 13 hours. Now we will add these two. 72 plus 13. So let's add 13 in this. 2 plus 3 will be 5. 7 plus 1 will be 8. So our answer will be 85 hours. This means 3 days 13 hours will be equal to 85 hours. Okay. So whenever you have to convert these types of questions. Then you will use these relations and you will use this method. It's very easy. So I hope that now you understood that how to solve these type of questions. So if you like this video then please share it. And subscribe to my channel for more videos. And also press the bell icon to get the notifications of my latest videos. See you in the next video with a new concept. Till then goodbye. Take care. Thanks for watching.